hello and welcome back to cynthia's conversation how are you guys doing it's a beautiful sunny summer day here today in wales so i hope you guys are okay anyway let's get into it this one was from a lady i'll read what she says been with my boyfriend for three years he's caring pays my rent he's talking about marriage but the truth is i have failed to love him plus he's not like my type because he has a good heart i decided to start a relationship with him but now i want to end this relationship please advise me okay so what you are saying is that being with your boyfriend for three years he's caring pays your bill he's talking about settling down with you and the truth is you fail to love him <clears throat> so for three years you know <laughs> sometimes you just listen to some people and said he took you three years to be honest with him and yourself okay this is what i think it's better you live now than to go and cheat on him when you are married because you don't love him. Because most women do that. They said, oh, because he's caring, he pays my bill, I'll stay anyway and then go out and do whatever. That means <sighs> you are lying to yourself and you are lying to him. You will make the marriage a living hell for both of you. As much as he will do anything to please you, he will fail to do that because you know they love with him. You're just there because of something. That doesn't make sense. And if it doesn't matter, you can't say, oh, let me stay now. Maybe it will get better. If for three years that you've dated this man, you still haven't fallen in love with him and you don't see that he's somebody that you want to spend the rest of your life with, then my darling sister, walk. Walk because... The reason why I said work is less complicated when you are still dating. But when you are married, it's all a whole bargain. Marriage is not like dating. It's better he can't him. I'm not talking about you. He can't his losses now that it's three years. Than he's going to count his losses when you are 10 years or 15 years into the marriage. And there are children involved in it. Because in that case. You will be unhappy. He will be unhappy. And the children that you are going to bring into the mess will be unhappy as well. Nobody wants that for their children. So, for me, like I've always said, I'm not here to judge anyone. On, but the reason why you went into the relationship in the first place was for selfish purpose. Not because, like you already said, he's not your type. So you knew from day one, this is not the kind of person that I want to date or this is not the man that I want to. But you still went on there because he's caring and he pays your rent. And now that he's talking about settling down, then the reality start to hit you and go, oh, I'm going to minute, what have I done? Oh, I'm not going to do this. I'm going to pack it up. I just don't understand. Sometimes I just... So for me... It's very easy. End the relationship now. Have a conversation with him to say, look, when we first started, even though you were not exactly, I like honesty. Some people will say that makes me naive, but I like honesty because I, as much as I am honest, I want people that I'm dealing with to be honest as well. No, no matter how brutal the truth is, I want to know. And I like options. Sometimes it's good to give people now options. Because if you tell him how you feel and he thinks that, oh, maybe we'll make it work and then you'll fall in love with me, you know, along the line, that's up to him because you've given him that option. But if you go into the marriage without letting him know how you feel and then hoping that you, so it's better that you are open, have the conversation, tell him exactly how you feel and see what he's gonna say it's more likely my said i don't want to continue with the relationship that's okay no one has died we move on that's life and for you just to help you in future if you do end up ending this relationship 
before you go into another relationship with somebody, you need to tell yourself, if this was somebody telling me this, how it would make me feel. Because that will help you make a better choice on your next relationship. Because sometimes when we end the relationship, they say, oh, this relationship was bad. There is one thing you've taken out of the relationship, which is a lesson you've learned. So you're going to take what you've learned in, inside this relationship to your next one. To so see, even if someone is caring and you have absolutely in your mind no oh no, this is not my type, then don't go into it in the first place. Don't even try and convince yourself that, oh, maybe I will do this, maybe. Because the, one of the bigger mistakes that we humans make is always we think we can change somebody. We think, oh, I can make this person. It, that's not how it works. It doesn't work like that. So tell him how you feel. Hear what he have to say. It's better now you end the relationship now because you're asking for advice. And my advice is to you is to work now that you are dating, not married, rather than getting married and then stepping out all the time because you feel some type of way about the man. And then take it from there. That's how my opinion is. It's up to you what you want to do, but this will be the easiest way rather than to keep it until it all blows out and all that and all that and before the children gets involved in it and other people so don't carry on with the relationship just end it and then i hope whatever decision he